Okay, what I have here is an old Murray breaker. It's an MH220. That means it's a, a two pole 20 amp breaker. These things are obsolete. So if you have these in your panel box, you might want to start collecting them uh, because they're going to be expensive soon or you may end up having to replace your whole breaker box. But you can tell uh, they have these two little bunny ears that, that pop out. Oops, down here. I'm trying to look at the viewfinder and point. But these two little bunny ears pop out on the other side. I don't know if you can see that one. So I can turn it so you can see it. But this one's defective. It's got burn marks. I don't know if you can see. But it was getting ready to start a fire. But uh, anyway, we, we found one online. And so let's open this little baby up. See if it matches. I'm hoping it's the same breaker. This is the risk you take when you order an obsolete breaker for someone online. You don't actually know if you're going to get what you think you're going to get, so we'll find out here in a second. My Gerber EDC. Well, it's packaged well. Well, it has the two little bunny ears, and it looks like a Murray breaker. It's 20 amp, so we'll see. The difference between this breaker, let's see if I can show you. This, the original breaker, has this little metal tab that was an extra piece that I could not find anywhere. All the ones that you will find online, if you have breakers like this, just have the two little, well, there it is. Blow me away. When I asked the guy, if it had the little metal tab, he said no. What about that? It does. What about that? Great. All right. Well, we're going to take this over to the job and put it in, and maybe we'll get these people back in business. And we'll see you there. What is that? It's a nice sandpaper stick so I can sand the terminals on the breaker panel. Yeah, possible. because... Get rid of that corrosion. <laughs> we're assuming that there's going to be corrosion on the panel. This is the old breaker. He's gonna show the new one. You better buy these while you can. <laughs> We're gonna sand. See if we can see that. Eric made a artist, and Eric made a took a paint stick and made a little sanding device to get the crud off the panel. Good idea. <laughs> Yeah, these are old Murray. Uh, they're, they, they've got, uh, what is it, Kraus Heinz yeah. stamped on them, but it's actually a Murray breaker. <laughs> Al, I mean, Eric, I'm going to let you go first. I was going to take a picture uh, just so I could show Mike while it was open. Yeah. Let me see if I can zoom in. They're all, are they all Murray breakers? They're all the same? I would assume so. Yeah. And ours goes right there. Why don't we check, why don't we just check to it? And also, let me get, see if I can get a... Is that a 100 amp or a 200 amp service? I bet you it's a 200 amp. A 100 amp wouldn't be big enough, I don't think. I did. It's 200 amp. Can you get? Can you tell by looking at them here that they're all cross highs? If they're the same type hookup, but yeah, that one like that's what What's the? Are. Is the panel labeled? Look over there on the right. That's the underwriters. Underwriters. The two I can see are both crowds on these. Let me see if I can get in there and get a picture of the 
because you were telling me the way they connect. Yeah, it's a little different. Mm -hmm. I've got a little bar that hooks onto on the back. Yeah. And then, where's the bus bar? For the level of zoom you're at. Where did these have to come out of? California. Holy cow. Yeah. That's, you know, it's like $70 just to get it here. Okay, so I've got the old one. Yeah. Huh. We're going to just try to clean the contacts off. Yeah. Feel like it's going in there again. <laughs> Don't hit too hard. <laughs> oh. You got power. Okay. It's not smoking. <laughs> It's not, no arcing or smoking or. Well, I, when I come out here, I heard <laughs> sizzling. You know. Yeah. When we. Yeah, that old breaker. Yeah, the only one I want to see next is that one right there. That mm -hmm. one. Yeah. And we did, we did just accomplish something because. Uh, at least we know what the other configuration is now. What amperage is that one? It's double fifteen. Oh look. So see that that is the That's the Siemens. Okay. That is what I was looking for. It's a different type? Yeah, that's what I was wanting to know right there. And so that's a Siemens. Um let me get in there. Okay. Q fifteen fifteen. Since I can't see it, I'll just tell the camera. <laughs> That's a Q fifteen fifteen. Obviously, it's two fifteen amp breakers. That's a two pole fifteen amp breaker. Okay, there's our. Yeah. Does have any markings on the cover? Oh, I'll, I'll let you put screws in. You won't check it. Grouse Hines. Oh, well, that makes sense. <laughs> United States Air Force. Is that from you or Mike? Well, Mike just retired. I'm, yeah. I spent 11 years on active duty. Oh, you did? Yeah, and I'm 100% disabled. Really? I'm, I'm mentally disabled. Aren't we all? <laughs> Aren't we all? <laughs> what did you do? Did you fly? No, I was a ground power. Really? That was the all most the important stuff. person. That was no. That was all the stuff that was on the ground to uh, test all the systems on all the aircraft. Huh? We provided the. Uh, How do you know Mike? You, he aren't. owns this house. No, I mean you don't know him other than that. Okay. That's it. But Eric seemed to think y'all were related or something. Uh, Only by branch of service. Yeah, that makes sense. <laughs>